Yeah! Hey, my name's Jerem Forrest, the president of the Margaret River Board Riders. Let's talk Margaret's. Margaret's loves power surfers. Margaret's is raw, it's windy, it's bumpy, it's powerful, it's everything. The ocean just comes together and you just go to battle with it. The forecast isn't amazing, but it isn't bad either. First week, it's looking pretty much flat, unfortunately. Maybe a start on the first day, but I think you're looking at next week is gonna be the week where they smash through all the heat. And there's a high period swell that'll kick in sort of Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. If that holds, you're gonna see like that three to five foot size, or even like two to four, which is personally perfect for Margs. It's high performance, you're gonna see big turns, big combos, and even big airs. My pick for the men's this year, I think Griffin is gonna go all the way this year. He got second to Gabby last year. He's on a roll with all the last few events. He's in the yellow jersey, but he's also got people that are stinging to get a result here as well, you know. Jack's back, Jack missed last year, home turf, serves amazing out Margaret's, knows the way really well. I think it could be a Jack Griff final. Jack will want to go back to back because he missed last year, this is his back to back here. Then there's other guys like Jacob Wilcox that knows the ways really well, needs a result, you know, he's at the back end, he's surfing, has lifted, he's stronger, more powerful. Other guys like Sammy Pupo, Cole Hausman's coming off the win at Bells. All these guys that are strong surfers are going to really do well at Margaret's. If you're throwing a lot of spray, Ramsey, Ramsey's going to be gnarly. All right, my pick for the women's. The women's, I'm thinking Molly Picklam is gonna go all the way this year. She didn't have the best result in Bells, so she'll be super hungry to do really well. Others like Tyler Wright, Lakey Peterson, Caroline Marks, you know, Tatiana West, they've all done well out here before. Dark horses for the women's, BMAC. She's not on tour this year. She's got nothing to lose. She's got semis the last two events. I'd be worried if I had her and I hate girls because she's, um, she's deadly out main break and she's looking really good this year. 